Hi there, Walter. Would you be able to outline your role with the club here? Yeah. I'm, I'm been a president of the club for the last few years. Um, it's a, an honorary position for him, but it means that uh, I'm able to come down and uh, and watch the training and uh, and just have a good look at, at what they're doing. And, uh, they've been doing some excellent work with uh, the people here, and they deserve a great deal of, deal of credit for doing so. Yeah, and a lot of the players here are moving on to professional clubs and things. So. Testament to the coaches here. Yes, of course. I mean, the work that they're doing, I mean, the, the unpaid work that they do is tremendous. And uh, from kids from five and six years of age um, all the way up, um, you know, they deserve a great deal of credit for the amount of hours that they put in. And, um, you know, Scottish football needs that kind of uh, work at the present moment, and uh, these guys are supplying it. Uh, like you're saying, the present moment, it's always a bit, a bit doom and gloom, really. So to see success at this kind of level. Gives, gives everyone a boost, really, doesn't it? Yes, of course it does. I mean, I, I, th I think, um, you know, all the, the, the coaching staff and everything, but it's not it's just at Arden Capel, where we're a local club, local community. It's, uh, it's a good thing, but all over Scotland, there are people doing a uh, great deal of good work for uh, for youth football. And hopefully that works its way up and Gordon Strachan can improve the fortunes at the very top. Um, yes, I mean, that's where it starts, hasn't it? I mean, you know, and possibly in Scotland, we'll be slow. Um, realising that, and um, you know that uh, the community needs volunteers to get people out, and the lads that, that work here at Arden Capel are, are doing a fantastic job. You know, it's the awareness, and, and then the work that's been done in the background is now, I'm sure, um, will be a benefit to Scotland in the, in the future. And you yourself, are you still obviously involved here, bits and pieces? No, you? I'm, uh, yeah. I'm retired. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's exhausting enough for me to come round and watch the kids training.